Okay, kitchen nightmares, what do we got? First up, we have a movie myth about a kitchen appliance disaster. Go on. All right, so the movie is Gross Point Blank. And in this famous scene, a bad guy inside of a convenience store throws a bomb inside of a microwave. Now, the bomb looks like some C4 with an electrical device attached to it. He sticks it into the microwave, turns it up to 60 seconds. Yeah, I know this is myth. And the hero just manages to get out of the store in time for the microwave to go ding, and then kaboom. Awesome. Yeah. Sounds like a recipe for disaster. But can a microwave really be used to set off an elaborately wired C4 bomb? And can it be set to detonate in exactly 60 seconds? Okay, so it sounds like all we need are some microwaves, some plastic explosives, and a date at the bomb range. Ah, I love cooking with C4. My favorite ingredient. C4 cuisine is best enjoyed and is safest down home on the bomb range. Look how clean that is. Shame we're gonna blow it up. So to properly test this myth, we didn't just choose any microwave off the shelf, we did our homework. Now, based on the one that's in the movie Gross Point Blank, we know a few things. First, it's in a convenience store. Second, it's physical size. And third, it's power level, which is 1,000 watts. Now, we purposely avoided using modern inverter technology and went old school, which is what this baby is. So, what's the plan? For this kitchen nightmare myth, we have three tests to our experiment. Number one, the control test. Now, this is just a hunk of C4 in the microwave for 60 seconds. Test two, the hunk of C4, but with a Hollywood wire system. We're emulating exactly what we saw in the clip. Number three, which is a hunk of C4, Hollywood wires, and a blasting cap. So maybe we can get that microwave to look a little like this car here. This season, myths will fall. <laughs> All new Mythbusters, Wednesdays at 9, only on Discovery.